Hello friends, Vinay here. In this video, you will learn how to clean install Windows 11 H2 on your PC. So if you don't know, clean installation is a process that delete everything and install fresh copy of Windows on the PC. Clean installation not only helps in uh, fixing up issues, but also helps uh, in improving the overall system performance. So let's learn how to do that. First of all, uh, you require Windows 11 to H2 installation media. I have already created a video on how to do that. So you can check the link in the description and create one. Next, you need to connect Windows 11 USB to PC or laptop and make sure your PC boots from Windows 11 USB stick. You can either do it uh, from a BIOS or use boot selection menu. Different PCs has different keys for opening a boot selection menu. So you can check manufacturer website for more details. Once done, reboot your computer. Once your PC start with Windows 11 bootable media, you will see the following Windows setup screen. Here, uh, you need to click on the next button and then install now button and this will uh, start the setup. Now here, if the Windows 11 is activated previously on the PC, then you don't uh, need to enter the product key. After the installation, Windows will uh, automatically reactivate here uh, you need to click on the link i don't have the product key and then click next here uh, you need to select the addition that was uh, installed previously on the pc uh, in my case it's windows 11 pro select it and then click next here accept the terms by checking this option and then click next on this screen uh, we will select custom option because we are going to perform clean installation of windows 11 version 2.2 h2 here uh, you need to delete all the partition available on the pc for that uh, select partition and then select delete do it once uh, you remain with unallocated uh, storage like visible on the screen now uh, create a new partition for that uh, select new give partition a volume or a size and then click apply once done select the installation partition and then click next now setup will start installing windows 11 on your pc you need to wait for the installation to complete Once done, PC will reboot automatically. After reboot, you will see the initial setup screen of Windows 11. So let's set up the PC. All the preferences initial setup are your personal. So it may vary uh, depending on your area region. So select accordingly. Here you need to select region or country. I'll go with United States. And then select right keyboard. I'll go with the default one that is US then click yes after that uh, click skip here give your PC a name and then click next after that your system will restart here I'll go with set of personal use but you can also use for work and school keep in mind that this screen will appear only if you are using a windows 11 pro edition then click next one of the thing about windows 11 initial setup that is changed in a version 2 to h2 is that you require microsoft account and active internet connection to finish the setup so the following screen is exclusive to windows 11 version 2 to h2 to create windows 11 account click on the sign button and then enter microsoft account credentials to log in Once you are logged in, continue uh, setting up your PC. Here on this screen, you can restore previous setting and preferences on your PC. But as we are performing a clean installation, we'll go with the set up a new PC. Next, uh, you need to create a pin and for that click here and then uh, the preferred pin. Once done, click OK. Here uh, you can turn on or off some uh, privacy settings. But you can manage these settings later as well so click accept for now now windows 11 also let you customize your experience so you can check these boxes or options 
but again i will go with the skip you can link your android phone to your pc again you can do that thing later as well so skip in case you want to use onedrive as your storage device then you can click next or go with the, this option only save file to this pc this will use your device storage in case you have microsoft 365 subscription then you can click on the customize or continue button but i don't have so i will click on decline here if you want to join microsoft xbox game pass for dollar one then you can click on join for dollar one but i'm not interested in this so i'll click on skip for now option at last setup will start checking for updates for the last time and after this screen uh, system will take around two to three minutes for the setup so that's it guys you finally reach the windows 11 home screen and you have successfully performed the clean installation of uh, windows 11 i suggest you to go to windows update settings page and check if any updates or driver updates are available please uh, install it for better user experience so that's it guys uh, i hope you find this video useful don't forget to like and subscribe my youtube channel for more interesting videos thanks for watching